because everyone's favorite animated sponge has been on the air since 1999, he's had his fair share of episodes. And when I say fair share, I mean an insane amount, dang! But that's to be expected when you're going on for 20 years. While the majority of these episodes are constantly rerun and most people know all about them, there are a select few that Nickelodeon almost never airs and those are holiday specials. But the one we'll be going over today is a bit of an exception because it isn't a holiday episode itself, but the sister episode is instead. Remember the classic storyline all about Spongebob and Patrick celebrating Valentine's Day? Yeah, that episode rarely airs unless it's around now because why would you air a Valentine's special in November or any other time besides February? But when we take a look at the sister episode of Valentine's Day, simply titled The Paper, something interesting is revealed. Chances are you haven't heard much about this episode since people just aren't talking about it, and that's because Nick airs it a very limited number of times per year. This isn't just a one-time thing either. I remember back when I was going through all the episodes as a kid, and the paper is one of the only ones I never knew existed until much later. The truth is, unless you're watching Nickelodeon around Valentine's Day, it's going to be extremely hard to find this airing, which means people don't really quote it or talk about it as one of the episodes from the Golden Era. Still, let's go over the paper. Is it any good, or does it deserve to be forgotten? Well, the plot is probably one of the most simple concepts you could possibly think of for these characters. Spongebob plays with a gum wrapper, and Squidward wants a piece of the action. I know you're probably expecting more, but that's about it. There's not much else to the story besides Spongebob versus Squidward and his jealousy. It's one of those classic formulas that's worked ever since the show's beginning. The crew manages to take such a small idea and expand it into a full 11 minute episode, despite being super simple. If we're talking about the quality of the paper, it's probably a bit different for everyone you ask. As for me, I'd say it's solid, but nothing too special. One of the reasons you never really hear quotes from it like every other pre-movie episode is not only because it rarely aired, but because there were very few memorable things about it. That's not necessarily bad though, since not every single episode needs meme material. But let's be real, this is worthy of being a meme. Oh, okay, well maybe some people did make it a meme. Though it didn't explode as much as a bunch of other episode moments. Honestly, I'm not disappointed that Nick barely airs the paper. While it isn't one of the worst episodes of Spongebob, it definitely ranks as one of the lowest in the golden era just because of how forgettable it is. Of course you'll enjoy it if you haven't seen it before, but rewatching it over and over like many other episodes just isn't the same. Of course, Nick could do one of their time slot things where they just air a single 15 minute episode instead of pairing it with the February only Valentine special, but the paper wouldn't really benefit from that. I'm sure there are people out there who really love this episode, though for me I'm not sad we almost never see it air on live TV. It's still kind of interesting how some people have yet to even hear of its existence, but that just goes to show how powerful cable TV was back in the day. Now you can stream the paper whenever you want, wherever you want, but back then TV was all we had and we relied on Nickelodeon to watch reruns. It makes sense that the majority of fans who grew up watching Spongebob on cable don't know much about the paper, since they would have to tune in during February or basically never hear about it again until the next February. What do you guys think of the Forgotten episode though? Does it deserve the fate it has of almost never airing and people not realizing it happened at all? Let's talk in the comments section. And by the way, yeah, this was my special Valentine's Day themed video. I didn't really need to make one, but here you go. Happy Valentine's Day. Anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Give a thumbs up and comment below let me know what you think. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.